Hey, okay, I'm back again. This is part two. Sorry about that, but I just saw Andre Briggs. He was the one who was the MC for the night, and he was just walking to the airport, so I saw him, and I wanted to just thank him and, um, and talk to him really fast just to get his perspective on everything, which was great because he gave me some feedback about my performance, saying, you know, I really do have what it takes, and he was impressed because he thought that I had done more shows than this. He, wasn't, he didn't know that that was my first show. So that was really cool that um, he, he said, I really do look really good. And then I, I wowed him whenever I came out on stage. So, And he's seen a lot of shows. He's emceed a lot of shows. He's been in a lot of shows. So that's really helpful to get the, his perspective on everything. He said, just whatever training I've been doing, keep doing that. Don't go crazy. You know, with, because I told him the things I wanted to train. He just said, don't go crazy with it. But, you know, stay, stay along with what Je, uh, Jeanette and Doug have me doing, and I'll be on, all set. So, um, really good to get that feedback. So, sorry for that little interruption. Um, so, I think I was somewhere along the lines of the camaraderie of backstage. Um, a lot of it being just like it was in gymnastics. I was talking to my dad about this and he said he's the one who really called my attention to the fact that it is so much like gymnastics. And I also said in, in the regard that he's saying, it's also like cross country. Everyone is really pulling for each other. As much as it is a competition, it's also, you know, everyone knows how hard everyone else has been working. You've been training and training and training and and our bodies show that. So we want to be as supportive for people as possible. Um, some of the other aspects that I wasn't expecting was, uh, I guess, the crowd applause. What you know, the, the crowd really does appreciate uh, the hard work that we've done as well. Just like within cross country or gymnastics. So you know, you applause for everyone, but or applaud for ev applaud everyone. But you know, when they see other things that they might not have expected, they they cheer even more. After the show, a girl was walking with my dad and I, but that my dad and me, and um, and she mentioned how how great my abs looked up on stage, you know. And so that's not even something that we really had to focus on, but yeah, you know, we were able to give some ab shots. So that was pretty cool that she noticed that, and and others did as well. So. Really, I'm on my way. My body, as Jeanette has said, each show, it'll be easier for my body to get down to where it is now um, and you know, shedding, shed, shedding the fat and everything because my body's used to it at this point. So I'm planning to stay within the 10 to 12 percent body fat range, even off season, and then just strip it down whenever it comes time for season. So I'm not going to go crazy. I know that lately you've been seeing different pictures on Facebook about the things that I've been eating. That won't last very long. I will be starting to pack my foods again. I'll probably take a week or so off from that, um, you know, measuring and all of that stuff, but eventually I'm going to get back on it because I just can't stay off that long. And it's not necessarily going back to a diet, but it is going back to my healthy way of eating, you know, the things that I've been doing all, all along. So clean eating, that's what I do. It's part of me and nothing's going to change that. So overall, um, that's just some of the musings that I have as of right now. I'm sure that there will be other things. And just because this competition is over doesn't mean that I'm necessarily going to stop my blog because I think this is good for me. helps me develop my my personality a little bit more. It helps me. I mean, even though I'm just, it seems like I'm just talking to myself, I know that people are watching. So it uh, gives me a chance to, um, you know, to really get myself out there. Um, some of the things that also are just lasting for me are the confidence that I was able to have going on stage because of all my friends and my family um, back home. They were so proud and I, I'm so thankful that I had a chance to, to represent them. And yeah, they, you know, just all the, all, the, all the support that I've been given has been overwhelming. And knowing that I had that behind me when I got up on stage, it made it that much easier to get up there and try to shine. So I am going home to the people who already thought I was a winner before I left, and that's amazing. That's a great feeling. So I'm very excited, and I'm signing off for now. Going to go catch this flight to Atlanta. Hopefully I'll be able to get out of there and home to see my boys and my husband. So that is it for now. Bye-bye.